everyone. Um, today I have. I uh, sorry for not being back. I was on vacation, but today I have a prediction trick, and I'll be showing it to you uh, in the tutorial. So, um, uh, right now I'm gonna need my pen and paper right here. And I'm gonna look through the deck. Hmm. Pick a card. And then... Okay. I got my card. I'm gonna write it down on this piece of paper. Yep. There we go. Okay. Whatever that is. Anyway. Um and what I want you to do is think of a number between one and fifty two since there are fifty two cards. It can be twenty six, twenty four, thirty nine, anything, you know? Uh seventeen, sure, okay. We're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Let's see if that was my prediction. Seven of spades, no. Okay, uh, I'm gonna help you out with this one. I'm gonna tap it for some more magic and let's try it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Seven of spades, mate. Right? Seven of spades. It's like more like a portobello mu mushroom, but anyway. Uh, so how to do this trick? All you have to do is note the top card, seven of spades, write it down on your piece of paper, and um, since you have the seven of spades on top, let's say they say for, uh, let's say they say the number five, go one, two, three, four, five. Obviously, the fifth card right here is not their card, right? But you say, uh, let's see. Uh, let me tap this deck and what you're doing is you're putting the first card which is the top card in whatever position their num what number they said and one and then you count again one two three four five there's a seven of spades see you next time